everyone. Welcome. I appreciate you guys joining in with me. Please hit subscribe and share with your friends and families and coworkers. Take a moment on this beautiful Earth Day to either roll out your mat or if you're coming from an office space, sit in your chair, plant your feet into the earth. Place one hand on your heart, one hand on your belly. Wherever you are, whether you have a mat or you're on the grass or the earth or the floor or the carpet, take a moment just to rock forward and back into your feet. Take a moment to feel the ancient rhythms of the earth pulsating through your feet. Day is my favorite day of the year. It's just a day that you can consciously choose to really connect to the earth, make different choices. Hopefully wherever you are, you have a beautiful blue sky, maybe the sun is shining. So as you come to the connection in your feet, spread the toes wide anchor into the feet like there's roots literally just drawing down into the earth feel a pulsating rhythm lift up through the crown of your head and just arrive just as you are becoming strong just as you are in this moment, just connecting to your breath, just as you are. So begin to inhale and exhale in and out through the nose. As you inhale, you'll inflate the torso, the belly, the heart, the chest. And as you exhale back out the nose, everything just softens and comes back to yourself within. So let's take a couple breaths like this. emotions or feelings that want to arise, let them flow through you, without any judgment. Releasing the arms down by your side, growing a little bit taller, letting the shoulders soften down away from the ears. And let's float our arms just up and down slowly, inhaling, Feeling the air as the arms rise up. And on the exhale, let's take our palms down and press the energy down through the body, root it down into the earth. Inhale, float the arms up. Maybe take a gentle bend into the elbows. Exhale, the palms down. Push any energy that's been Kind of hanging out in the crown of your head, the face, the neck, the shoulders. A couple more. Staying connected to breath and body. Vision Mother Earth taking all your stuff away. Everything you don't want to carry. Let her take it. One more. Beautiful palms down by your side, anchor like a mountain here. Staying connected to the breath. Let's bring our hands to heart center, just set an intention for your practice today, what can you do to connect more to the earth, be a little more earth friendly, earth conscious? Just place that within your body, in your heart. And then let's interlace our hands, bring our hands behind our head. 
As you inhale, pull the crown of the head up. And as you exhale, dump over to the left side, almost like a tea kettle here. So as you dump over to the left, open up through the whole right side of the body. So stay anchored in that right foot, maybe pulling the elbows back a little bit for what's comfortable for you, keeping the hips neutral. Breathe here, let everything empty out. Once again, better take it. And then inhale back up. Exhale over to the other side. And inhale it up. On the exhale, pull the arms back. Let the, sh the heart shine forward. Gaze up. And then exhale, close the elbows towards one another, curl the chin to the chest, let's roll down to our forward fold, Uttanasana. I'm gonna turn towards the front of my mat. Take a moment here. You're welcome to take a generous bend into the knees. You want your spine to lengthen here, releasing the head and neck, yes and no. On your inhale, sweep the arms back like you can fly. Half lift, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale and fold. One more time, inhale, half lift. Exhale and fold. Bend into the knees, lift the arms, sit back into your chair pose, Uttanasana. So just nice sit here, maybe a gentle bounce even. Reach out through the fingertips, soften the shoulders. Find this long line of energy through the back of the body. Sit back in your heels, maybe lift the toes. Take an inhale here. And on the exhale, forward fold. Sweep the arms back, straighten the knees, half lift. Take an inhale and exhale, sit. Chair pose. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, chair. Inhale. Half lift. Exhale, chair. One more. Inhale, lift. And exhale, chair. Beautiful. Take an inhale. And exhale, forward fold. Take a moment just to bend into one knee at a time. Maybe move the hips. Release the head and neck. So we're just connecting to the earth, moving our body. Start to ragdoll your way up slowly. Again, anchor into the feet. Reach the arms to the sky and gaze up. Exhale, hands into the heart, pause. Stand tall, Tadasana. Not even the wind can push you forward. Back to your breath. Receive an inhale, gaze up. Exhale, micro bend into your knees. Forward fold all the way down. From here, let's take a giant step back with our left foot. Runner's lunge, pull the right hip back. As if you're taking off here, just be grounded, find strength. And then we'll cartwheel the arms up, plant that back foot down, warrior two. Deep bend in that right knee. Soften here, maybe a gentle pulse, and just stay here. Beautiful, bring your arms into heart center, and then press the energy out. Inhale it in. Exhale it out. One more. Inhale, hands together. Exhale, press it out. Cartwheel the arms down, back to runner's lunge. We're gonna slide the left knee down. Take that left foot off the mat just a little bit and sit ourselves back into a little shoelace. Take a moment to let the hips ground into the earth here. So 
Sit up nice and tall. Bring your hands to your heart space. Anchor into your roots. So as you breathe in, root down. One more inhale. Sit up nice and tall. Exhale, fold forward. Let your hands release. And just let your hands walk forward. Let your head relax. If you want to find a gentle sway, feel free to take a gentle sway. If stillness feels better, allow yourself to be still. Stay connected to your breath and the earth. Next inhale, slowly rise up. Let's sweep our legs around, coming to a tabletop. Anchor into the earth with the hands, the shins, the tops of the feet. Curl the toes under. On your inhale, drop the belly, let the chin lift. Exhale, tuck, curl and round, let the tops of the feet connect. Inhale through your cow. Exhale, curl, tuck and round. Two more. Beautiful, coming back to a neutral tabletop. Curl the toes under, let's walk our hands back. Lift the hips up, forward fold at the top, I'm sorry, at the bottom of your mat. And then ragdoll your way up, anchoring once again into the earth, feeling the rhythms underneath the feet. Roll the shoulders back, palms by your side, Tadasana, mountain pose. Nathan says the blessing isn't to walk on water, but that miracle is to walk on the green earth, dwelling in the present moment. Take your hands to your heart, eyes closed if you can, and just walk forward, whether you're on your mat or on the earth, just walk forward a couple of steps. Top of the mat. Beautiful. Release the arms down by your side. Let's inhale the arms up. And exhale, forward fold all the way down. Take your feet a little wider. Take opposite elbows and just sway side to side. Your feet are nice and rooted and you're just swaying in the wind, just side to side. waterfall off the crown of the head. Coming back through to center, plant your feet, heel toe your feet back in line. Giant step back with your right foot, runner's lunge. Let your heart pour forward, let your feet stay anchored. And we'll pivot that back foot down, cartwheel the arms up, find a very gentle warrior two. And maybe take a little bounce here. Or find stillness, close the eyes. On your inhale, bring the palms together. On your exhale, press the energy away. Inhale together. Exhale it away. Inhale together. Exhale away, one more. Inhale it together. And exhale it away. Cartwheel the arms down, come back to that runner's lunge. We'll drop the back knee down. Take that foot off the mat, we'll come to that shoelace. Left leg over the right, and also sit in a comfortable seat. Sit up nice and tall, hands to heart. Inhale, brings you tall. Exhale, fold forward to your degree. Again, maybe finding a gentle sway up and down or side to side. Or maybe just pausing in stillness. Notice what you need. 
is your practice. I'm just simply guiding you, so please get what you need. Let your hands, your palms press into the earth. Feel yourself grounded and solid, connected. above the knees best you can, getting this nice twist in the lumbar low spine. Plant your left hand by your face, press away from the earth. Inhale that arm up. Exhale, pull that energy into your heart. And release the hand down. Let's take one cat cow. So go ahead and drop the belly, lift the tailbone, curl the toes under, chin up. Exhale, tops of the feet connect, press away from the earth, tuck and round. Inhale yourself back through center, right hand stays grounded, left hand to the heart. Inhale it up to the sky. Exhale, thread it through. Coming down to the outer shoulder. Breathing here into this low back twist. Feel your connection to the earth here, where the points of the body are in contact with the floor, the earth, your mat, and just be present with that. Beautiful right hand presses into the earth as you press yourself up, bring your left hand to your heart. Inhale it back up to the sky. Exhale, release it down. Let's take some barrel rolls here. Pull your ribs over to the right side. Drop the belly down through your cow. Tailbone lifts, chin lifts. Ribs reach over to the left side. Round through your cat. So take two more in this direction. Connection to the body, connection to the earth. When you come back through your cat, pause. Before we go to the other side, press your hips back over your heels, extend your arms long, find child pose. Take a moment to soften into the earth, to connect to your breath. and press yourself back up to table. This time we'll pull the ribs, intercostals over to the left. Drop the belly, chin up, over to the right, round through your cat. Two more. Just be with all sensations in your body. And back through to center. 
Roger, beautiful. Let's come down onto the earth, the floor, the mat. And let's take the soles of our feet together for a little butterfly. Hanging on to the ankles here, take a moment to just let your wings flap. This is a beautiful thing to do daily. So what it does is it opens up through the hips and it allows synovial fluid to flow freely, anything that gets kind of stuck in your hips. Nice thing to do on Earth Day or every day. Big breath in, sit up tall, pause. And then exhale, bow forward as you hinge at the hips. Nice long spine, pulling yourself towards the earth when you no longer can go. You can grab onto your toes. You can keep your hands on your ankles, maybe elbows pressing the knees down. And just round here, relax. Let your shoulders soften. Let your head and neck relax and breathe. Feel yourself lift up and out of the back body. Feel the stretch in your lumbar spine. Next inhale, roll yourself up slowly. Chin to chest, crown of the head's the last to come up. And let's find the Sukhasana easy seat. Sit up nice and tall, adjust, allow your sit bones now to anchor into the earth. Take an inhale here. Exhale, drop the right ear to the right shoulder. Inhale up through center. Exhale, left. Inhale the head up. Exhale to the other side. Inhale the head up and exhale over to the left. From here, let's rotate our chin towards our chest. We're gazing down into the earth, soften the shoulders. Imagine there's a string on the crown of the head, the top of your head, and it's pulling it forward. Feeling this beautiful stretch through the back of the neck, the sides of the neck. And then inhale the head up. Release the arms down by your side. Let's inhale, float the right arm up to the sky and over to the side. As you inhale, feel that reach. And as you exhale, can you pull the arm open? And exhale. One more. Inhale. And exhale. Let's take both arms up to the sky. Inhale. Root down. Exhale. Hands to heart, chin to chest. Just return to your intention you set for your practice for this earth day. Release the right hand down. Let's float the left arm up and over. And we'll exhale, peel it open. Gaze up to the sky. Inhale it up and over. Exhale and open. Two more. time right now. There's so much going on in the world. If I could share anything with you, it would be to remember that we are all the same. We are all one. We're different religions. We're different cultures. We're different colors. We are all one. We're beautiful humans on the inside and out. Be kind. Spread love. Be open and understanding. Just be one with the earth much for sharing this little practice with me and I will see you soon. Namaste.